What is going on YouTube and welcome back to the Clear Cryptos educational channel. My name is T Hobbs from the Crypto Shop and of course you know I got my man Jay Seals with me. What's going on brother? What's good everybody? Listen guys today on the channel we're going to be discussing a story that's kind of near and dear to my heart. I absolutely love the Super Bowl. The thing that I love the most about the Super Bowl is the commercials but for whatever reason crypto this year has been completely banned from Super Bowl commercials. So, Justin, take us away. Let us know what's going on, brother. Yep. So, the New York Post initially reported that crypto commercials are banned from appearing as Super Bowl ads following FTX's collapse. Concern over the now-disgraced crypto firm and the arrest of its founder have left the biggest game of the year steering clear of crypto. Mark Evans, ex uh, executing vice president of ads, sales for Fox Sports told the Associated Press that there's zero representation in the category at all in this year's Super Bowl. Moreover, stating that several crypto companies had made efforts with FTX's downfall, quickly disintegrating those opportunities. Just one year ago, Super Bowl 56 featured a lot of crypto companies appearing in commercials. Yet FTX, Coinbase, Crypto.com, and eToro, and they spent millions of dollars for 30-second adverts in the biggest game of the NFL season and the biggest game of the year because everybody watches the Super Bowl. I don't care who you are. You probably watch Super Bowl. If not for the game, definitely for the ads. So right. the commercials featured star-studded celebrity guests from Larry David and the NBA icon himself, LeBron James, who we know is big into crypto and crypto.com. However, this year will be a different story as crypto commercials are effectively banned from Super Bowl ads because of FTX. The decision to not represent the digital asset industry during advertisements was a conscious one according to evans there were some companies in the mix before the ban but because of ftx they got x nade two crypto companies have reportedly already had super bowl ads booked and done said evans additionally noting two other companies were on the one yard line Ooh, i like the nfl pun there <laughs> but ftx's collapse and their criminal enterprise forced the nfl to look elsewhere Last year, FTX was a primary crypto company featured in the Super Bowl, probably because they had that money, that fake money. I mean, it was real money, but we know it wasn't real money. So <laughs> Now we know, right? <laughs> <laughs> right. And these commercials did raise the status of the industry as a whole, as the Super Bowl ads is the most watched event of the year, drawing in 100 million viewers in 2022. It's crazy how people who don't even watch the NFL just watch it for the ads and just the commercials alone. So, Hobbs, do you think that crypto ads are going to be banned forever from the Super Bowl? Or is that crypto money just too juicy for the NFL to stay away for too long? Here's the thing. The NFL, when it regards to the Super Bowl, doesn't really need anybody's money, right? They have lines of people waiting in line to get on to that Super Bowl ad list. So it's not about whether or not they need the money. I don't even think the Super Bowl believes that crypto won't have commercials by next year, right? I think that this is just a response to all the negativity flowing around one particular collapse, that collapse being FTX. And we know FTX was, was, was specifically promoted by one of the greatest football players of all time, Tom Brady. I think that connection is way too close for the NFL to even chance the chance of having another black eye on the NFL and I think that has a lot to do with why they're banning crypto. Tom Brady's in that lawsuit, wrapped up in that lawsuit with all of the other big time players that were uh, promoting FTX. It's just a lot. It's just a it's a slippery slope that I feel like the NFL doesn't have to waste time playing on. So good on them. Honestly, I think this is good for the NFL. I don't think it's bad for crypto. I think this is more like a more like see you later as opposed to goodbye to crypto next year. I think we'll be in better shape though. Yeah. I think it just depends on the market for the most yeah. part. If the market turns around then I think, I think maybe the Super Bowl or Fox will just have to vet some of these companies just a little bit better. You know, the crypto companies better. You they vet them to make sure just that like they everybody legit. else. Yeah. 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 But I mean, betting, betting companies, betting these ads and not just allowing you know, companies to spend millions of dollars for the placement and making sure they're actually good companies that you want to be represented on your channel is also just as important. So I feel like that could be kind of the reason why 
they're like, well, we got burned once. You burned me once, but you won't burn me again. So big facts, big facts. Well, you guys let us know what you think in the comments down below. Don't forget to like subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Come back over to the Clear Cryptos educational channel. Check me and my check me and Jay Seals out over here. But not, my name is T Hobbs from the Crypto Shop. That man above is Jay Seals, and we'll catch you guys on the next one, man. Peace.